Hi, I'm Alex. My name is Sergey. We talk about table tennis. We are Table Tennis 11. Hi again. Today we are commentating another Table Tennis match. According with your feedback, you liked our first experience in this field. Today, we are talking about Estonian individual championship. This is men's singles, as you may see. Final match between Maxim Vuhka and Thomas Libene. The match takes place on September 5th, 2021. We can say also that due to the pandemic situation, it was championship was postponed, it was supposed to be played in the very beginning of 2020, but actually it's uh, beginning of September 2021. Thomas Liebene. Uh, was seeded as number two, according to Estonian rankings, and uh, Maxim Vuhka was seeded as number nine. Is he absolute favorite in this match or not? He's more, more experienced also according to his age, and I think he has already placed once this kind of final. So it's not a matter of favorites, uh, but I think he has more experience in this. I would say most of uh, spectators and table tennis people in Estonia, they were thinking that uh, this medal should go to Thomas. Even even me, I was thinking that it was very difficult challenge for Max to 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 win this match. I was playing against uh, both players and I was practicing with Maxim. So for me, it was not nice. For me, it was obvious Maxim is not a uh, weaker player, uh, but quite the opposite. I think uh, he was practicing a lot and uh, he was very confident in some matches uh, during the this season. So. So we see that Max is leading. Score is 5 2 for him. What, what is your opinion? How was the beginning of the match? The beginning of the match uh, is quite nervous, as usual, for the finals from my point of view. So the points are short. Uh, so there are some uh, unforced mistakes from, from both sides. Uh, Maxim is. Uh, missing to return some serves, like here, so it is nervous beginning. You coaching Maxim uh, at this match. Uh, how do you define the strategy for this match? Before the match, Max asked me how he should play. And together we decided that there are some, let's say, two or three crucial things which we, we would like to follow during the whole match. First of all, I asked him to close the game as much as possible. Means if the ball is short and he really doesn't need to attack, 
he also has to play short. And then first attack and even the second one uh, should be with uh, lots of spin and not so powerful. This is because Thomas is really playing very good when uh, somebody is attacking and uh, his his receipt and his counter uh, attack with counter spins is very dangerous so the the main task was to try to close the game and to attack difficult and also exact placement it should be deep to his backhand side or in the middle of his body so it should be a lot of spin but not so much speed yes exactly yes exactly and uh, as you may see the first set it was very successful first of all he managed to follow these tactics and these tactics was quite successful The game was really a lot of easy mistakes, but at the same time, you can feel the tension because this is a champion's match and both players are not confident at the same time. You can see that they want to win. Max was leading and then two easy mistakes. He cannot receive the service. Three, three mistakes in a row. Uh, from 9 6, the score went to 9 9. I think that Libina is under bigger pressure according to his like behavior because uh, he expects or he was expecting that he should win Maxim because maybe he thought he would play in the end against Vainola or other former Why? champion. And here it should be his match according to his estimation, I think, and this makes the game difficult for him. Yes, actually, I think you are right. Uh, a lot of pressure on both of them, but uh, maybe uh, Thomas feels feels more pressure comparing to Max. Yeah, you can express it differently, but I, I just meant Maxim is prepared better psychologically at this stage of, of the match from my point of view. So he feels more confident so even under pressure he is more confident last service was difficult to judge from this uh, angle it seemed that max made very strong side spin and top spin service at the same time the ball went a bit higher than not than usually and thomas was not ready for this so cannot say exactly was it mistake from max which was which leads to to the to win the first set or it was made 100% intentionally so the first set is over max uh, leading 1-0 what do you think now the situation is the same as it was in the beginning or max should play more with more convenience so from my point of view it depends how long the ball exchange would be so if Libene Thomas will be able to hold uh, the ball longer in the game because if he is not able to hold the ball longer in the game or to keep the ball longer in the game it will be same style of uh, the game so in other words if Libene managed to make long rallies and we enjoy this match then uh, most probably he will, he wins and if not, if Max will manage to to play as uh, less shots in the rally as possible, then advantage would be on, on his side. And my, my question would be if Thomas is going to change anything in, in his game after the first uh, set. So I don't know if you changed any tactic or uh, expected changes. Thomas style in the, in the second set. 
after the first set, I remember I told Max that everything is going according with the plan and we don't need to change anything. And also, I wouldn't say that Thomas can really change much in this situation. So you think he's not able to yeah, to to keep the ball in the game, just to play play more passively and uh, let Maxim more attack? I would say it now more def depends more on Maxim than on Thomas. Max was leading not only the first set, but uh, he's leading in the game. In other words, he dictates the style and the temper of the game. So from my point of view, Thomas needs to do something, but at the same time, I don't, I don't understand uh, what he can do if Max will continue the same way and... Uh, but uh, I remember what you, was, you were talking about, Max's strategy not to play so strong, but to play with better placement. And this is what Thomas is not doing. So he's trying to put extremely f strong first topspin and uh, he misses a lot. Yes, and also some, sometimes he misses uh, the, his first attack. And also while receiving uh, topspin from Max, he's trying always to block, uh, especially from his backhand side. He's blocking uh, quite actively, but the ball has not enough power and uh, it often goes to the net. It's it's not no not fast enough just to be returned. You see, uh, when Thomas managed to make a good service, Max has a problem for to receive the ball. Then he has advantage. Uh, otherwise, Max is leading the game. Yeah, Max is leading the game. That that's 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 seen because he's. Uh, attack from my point of view is more precise and more it's 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 not fast but it's more powerful and very difficult for thomas to to block yes you may see what well, this is this is the long rally but max is not playing too powerful and thomas is uh, far away at, at this point too too far away mm. the ball is simply uh, shorter mm. than he expect you see also first attack, very good placement and very good timing also. So the second set, uh, Max is leading. And then again, uh, this uh, service receipt problem. Thomas is serving very good uh, long serve, so they're not uh, well seen because sometimes he hides it with with his body and then it's very difficult to read the spin and uh, direction of, of the serve and i think this is uh, one of his strongest sides this is uh, first serve and then good attack after yeah see if i would coaching thomas i would say that Minimum 75% of his service should be long. Not half long, but long and fast. Luckily for Max, uh, he was serving quite uh, often short and half long. You see also the placement is very good. So he's playing to the body or to the backhand side as it was, as it was decided or planned. For me, the body language of uh, Thomas shows that he is not uh, confident how to change the situation. So now is Max to leading 2-0, but I uh, always remember and trying to remember to Max that Thomas is very good in the situation when he is down. So even, even if the score is 0-3, it could it could not be the end yeah, when thomas is under pressure so he becomes angry and he's he has good anger for 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 himself so he it makes him move and be more uh, precise and uh, 
more disciplined? I would say that Thomas' strong side is the ball feeling. He he can play various uh, game. He can attack. He can uh, he can be he can play as number two. So he has a lot of variation. So sometimes he changes a lot uh, when he is down, and then he managed to change the situation in his in his favor. Even if you have very uh, good ball feeling, you need to still have a lot of practice and uh, be prepared to win the final of the championships. You see, uh, flip is also good. So Max was playing two times short in a row, and then Thomas managed to make a very good flip. But next, next ball, uh, first attack. First attack is still, though it's already uh, the third set. Thomas cannot manage. Yeah, if uh, Maxim performs first attack, then Thomas has uh, a lot of difficulties to return to to to, to the table. You see long service and point for Thomas. And 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 Max is not ready for this open game. Yeah, it's open game and then yeah, it's uh, somehow it's very convenient for Thomas. Yeah, and then this easy mistakes from Max unforced, let's say. Yeah, but it was not clear if the service was short or long, so it was really somewhere in the middle and uh, it was uh, not easy to to detect the, the the length of the serve. When Maxim attacks himself, then only luck can uh, bring the point to Thomas. It looks yeah, like this. this. This is exactly the case. Mm -hmm. First attack. You see first attack and then second not so powerful and ball goes again to the next. Yeah, and with the back and Thomas tries to block, but he can't uh, spin, like make loop against loop. So it is uh, he's in in the losing situation. Yeah? So here again, uh, not confident. As you may see again and again, Max has a lot of problems to receive, to receive the service. And now he serves himself, so it, I th think it should be again he, he, his point. Yes, mm -hmm. exactly. But it seems that Thomas has this. This was not very good receipt from Thomas, but uh, normally Thomas managed to to receive very good. But somehow, from my experience, Maxim has very strong uh, forehand uh, topspin at the moment. It's very, very difficult to block, and this is put enormous, enormous pressure. Then you have to think how not to let him uh, make this first topspin. And uh, Thomas uh, has no time to counterattack against it. So it's like quite a deadly situation for him. You see, Thomas is winning his his uh, points when he serves. Yeah, it was also close to win this one, but he was not uh, somehow. Maxim used this backhand flip, which yeah, is though, both, though, yeah. though the ball was not so long, not so short. And then too many short short for Max. I think he can he can flip in this in this case. Yeah, but it was like an uh, unusual point for, for 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 this match. But if Maxim attacks, then yeah. yeah. If we are talking about the body language, you see Thomas is watching on his racket. Yeah, so this is not a good sign for him. This is not good sign for anybody. Yes, exactly. <laughs> for the opponent, it's a good sign. <laughs> Who serves now?
second serve service from Thomas because he 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 won the previous so it's let's see if he serves long it was half long yes and then Play easy mistake one. not easy mistake because, because top spin was not 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 Maxi, really yeah added a lot of spin to the ball so it was the movement was short and uh, the ball was not fast but still it was not clear how much spin uh, the ball took from 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 and now to zero ten eight it's important as always yes very good flip and as you said uh, this short short game is not in favor of maxim so yes, this is, yes. Yeah, so he he is not uh, winning the points in this situation so it's better to transform it into a long long game yeah this this was exactly what i told him after the and then uh, service was very good this... yeah, it touches the edge of the table and uh, it it was some kind of luck but from my point of view thomas was not ready again as the same as in the first set when he lost this serve and now the score is 3-0 uh, we we will see how thomas will start to play in this in this uh, situation but what do you say to maxim in this situation when he is leading 3-0 i said that it's not over you know that Thomas is very strong when he has a lot of pressure and when he is down, he's playing even better. And uh, practic concerning practical, th practical things, I said that uh, he needs to quit from this short game. If he feels no confident enough, uh, if he feels himself not confident enough to make a flip, then he can uh, push the ball long with, with some backspin. Did you give any advice to Maxim how to receive long serves? Do you think? I told I only I told told him that he needs to be ready for the long service always. You see, two two zero down, and now uh, Thomas is serving. So Thomas looks like more alive now. So he has some kind of maybe more energy. And then again, very spinny stroke from Max. Thomas cannot manage. Yeah, so Thomas cannot manage with his bank and uh, the top spin from Maxim. So almost uh, n no positive returns, many mistakes. And now I think when, when Max. Uh, managed to make score even in the fourth set he feels more more, more free and uh, more, maybe a little bit more relaxed in the positive way maxim yes yes you see he's not uh, afraid of long rallies and moving moving good yeah, because very often when the title of uh, the champion gets near for some players it's uh, like they g g got paralyzed so because now it's so near yes yes but not not in this case i think he was uh, he he was expecting that it would be difficult until the end again the same picture uh, thomas has a good, a very, very strong advantage on his uh, service, but but not every. Yeah, so so it this, was... this was very nice, uh, beautiful rally. Uh -huh. And Thomas was not ready that for the last return, so it was. Now, score is four four, but I think. Max even even Max is down four or five in the first set, but uh, I think he was he was he is quite confident. Yeah, he's uh, he feels the rhythm of the game. That's 
Yes. Now he attacks, and then Thomas was trying to block with his forehand from the backhand corner. Oh, it was good placement in the middle of the table. Now Thomas to serve, so if he serves long, let's see. Oh, he serves short. Luckily, he could block this th th this time. And it was quite fast, and Maxim was out of the position. We'll see if uh, the second wall serve will be also short. Now, good, good attack. Now, Max will serve at uh, six. six uh, he is losing five seven. Yes, mm -hmm. exactly. Mm -hmm. And he uses his towel break, and I think this is very good. At this point, I think they didn't use so many towel breaks altogether. Not every. Mm -hmm. Back and service. But it was new serve, I think. Yes, so it was new serve and also with a lot of backspin. Uh, but it was clear that it was, but it, it, he didn't expect that much. Yes, and then topspin service. Mm -hmm. Very good counter attack from Thomas' side. Somehow he managed to put the ball out. Of the table. Now it's very stressful moment. Very easy mistake from. Oh, well, it looks like the the ball has touched the edge, so it was the edge ball. So according to Thomas' reactions, we we can't see the ball from here. Very good receipt. At the same time, Thomas was showed excellent footwork. Yeah, but he he showed he also gave his all power, so with the hope that the ball could not be returned. But this it's you can't hope on this level that you can win the point with one game. And opposite Maxim made quite a slow topspin with a lot of spin, and it was very difficult to return. And Maxim was ready anyway to to continue his attack. Backspin serve again, yeah. So it looks like a lot of spin because uh, the ball goes in the bottom of the net, so it's very far away from being returned. So and now it's uh, two match points, two championship points, two championship points. This is yeah. yeah. Maxim becomes a champion. Yes. And the game was very tough, though the score was 4-0. I think not, not a single set was easy for yes. Max. At the same time, uh, it was a lot of nerves, a lot of short movements, a lot of easy mistakes, but some points were very nice. Yeah, but it was feeling that my, Maxim has an advantage altogether. So, of course, in table tennis, it can be changed in any moment. But uh, Maxim has managed to keep the this uh, his advantage till the end of the match. Okay, now you see some best scores of this match, and our congratulations to Max, to our table tennis eleven team. Yeah, because we were part of his preparation, so we were coaching him and playing with him, and uh, we were very happy that he could win this title. Yes, and now in our test team, we have Estonian, current Estonian champion. Congratulations to us. <laughs> As always, we are waiting for your comments, for your questions, and hope to see you soon. Thank you very much. Goodbye. <laughs>